Hi guys, we're back at Smash Fishing. We're out at Brendan tonight and it's seriously late and hopefully we can find some lobsters. So stay tuned, we might even find some fish. It's Smash Fishing, baby. <laughs> Did I get him? Yeah, I got him. There's a lobster. Sorry? You got one there as well, is it? Yeah. One lobster there, guys. Nice one, definitely not a keeper. But at least we're starting to find them. We were walking for about 10 minutes and not really seeing a huge amount. But hey, we're starting to find them now. A little bit soft, that lobster. But actually, yeah. it's been a bit slow at the moment, guys. We're not really seeing a huge amount. We've seen a couple of small lobsters, but no keepers, no bass at the moment. Fingers crossed things start picking up. <laughs> Can I get him? Oh, I got him. Got another one down there. I'm not sure if that one's going to be a keeper or not. That'll be close. We will see. It's very slow pickings today. Doesn't seem to be a huge amount around, that's for sure. Nah, that's well out, that one. Nice to see. That's a male, that one. Come on, give us a big one. I've just found myself a telephone. Look at that. This one's been in the wars. It's got no claws. It's only got a few legs left and they look a bit manky. Hopefully he survives. <laughs> Can't resist a nice big prawn. <laughs> Quite a few round, but they are right in the weeds, guys. So I don't know if we're going to be able to get tons of them tonight. But we will certainly try. Oh yeah, got that one. A good average size at the moment. Last year they were quite small, the shrimp. So it's nice to see some bigger ones around. A couple more nice ones here. Lovely job. And we got another one. Another little wee one. Not the monsters though. Struggling to find the keepers today. But at least we're finding them. Oh, it was a bit bigger than that. <laughs> yeah. They obviously magnetise it a little bit. Oh, they do, eh? Yeah, it makes them look a bit bigger. Yeah, it's amazing how many's around, though. Yeah, it's done, though. Just not keepers. Come on. That's a lovely big prawn, that one. Look at that. Nice, juicy. Don't know if it's going to be a keeper, though. There's lobster in here, guys. Oh, she's soft. No, that would have been a keeper. <laughs> yeah, definite keeper. That. Oh, it had to be soft, eh? Yeah. Yeah. Look at that. That would have been an absolute mile. Lovely big male lobster there. Big claw. That's a shame. Oh well, we'll chuck that back. I'm not cooking soft lobster today. Hopefully, we can find a uh, another big one. I'm starting to find a few lobsters just walking around here, guys. I don't know if you can see that down there. It's just scooting around. <laughs> They're starting to starting to find a few in here, eh? Just no big keepers yet. Where's all the keepers? Brendan's got a lobster. That's going to be close. That's going to be in that one. You reckon, eh? That's going to be in, I reckon. Yeah, that's in. Ah, for sure, eh? Yeah, that's definitely in, mate. For sure. We don't really have to measure that. Nah, it's definitely size, eh? Yeah. Only one claw, but... Nice and solid? Yes. Yeah, Whoa. Oh. <laughs> Oop. Oh, well done, mate. Yeah, they're small at first. Oh, right. they do it sometimes, eh? Right. Yeah, God, this gauge is a nightmare. Yeah, look at that. Beautiful. That's in about four mil, mate. Yeah. Lovely lobster. Awesome. Well done. Smaller than that. Finally got one. <laughs> <laughs> look at the size of that sea lemon. Really cool to see. That's a monster. I haven't found one that big in a long time. 
It's funny, they they lay eggs that look like a rose, a sort of a rose flower. Really cool. And they can be orange, white. Really nice to see. Put them back down there. There's another one down here, guys. Look at that. Definitely not legal size. But it just shows there's lobsters absolutely everywhere. <laughs> just swarms and swarms of baby lobsters. They are everywhere. That was a lovely big hole under there, but just one little one. Got him. <laughs> that one, I think, is gonna be it. <laughs> Finally. Just double check to be safe. And look at that, guys. About two or three millimeters in that beauty. Finally got a keeper. <laughs> God, the amount of lobsters we have seen tonight is unreal. In this one pool, eh? Oh, crazy. Must have at least easy 15, eh? Oh, easy. Maybe more. Maybe more. It's crazy. But hey, we got a lobster out of it. Well, chirping with that, guys. Me and Brendan have both got a keeper now. So what we're doing is just going to keep going through all the holes. And we're going to try and find some little creatures along the way. And fingers crossed, we get lucky. There's no shortage of these around at the moment. The congas are absolutely everywhere, just like the lobsters. Do you know what they say, guys? Where there is a conga, there's usually a lobster. We've come to a different part of the uh, beach now, guys. We are in a giant pool. So you can see how clear and flat the water is. You'll be able to spot a bass from quite a long distance. It's so peaceful, just milling about like this. Check the colours out on that little beast, guys. That's a spiny squat lobster. This is a juvenile one. They take on all sorts of different colours. You probably can't see it very well in the camera. You can see there's red, brown, yellow, blue. All different colours in it. Such a pretty little creature. The size of these brittle stars. These are lovely to see. I love the way these things move around. Look at that. They just scurry along the floor underneath rocks. Feeding on any little crustaceans they can get their hands on. Or their arms on, shall I say. Cool though. Back you go, my friends. Oh, they all stuck to me. There we go. First basil of the night. It's an absolute tiny little thing though. <laughs> nice to see though. It's a shiner. There we go get the weed off it if it doesn't flap out my hands there you go nice little bass there first one we've seen tonight it's been absolutely That's dead so yeah. but still beautiful little fish i love the gold on it see you later buddy oh, it's off. <laughs> That's a spider crab oh, spider crab is it it's only so far he yeah, can go. Far. There he is. Right. Look at him go, guys. Done that right there. Sure, eh? That's another keeper. Okay. Nice male as well. Oh no, that's another. That's a female. That one. Nice solid lobster. Yeah. That. Yeah. And we are really close to the top of the beach. Oh yeah, look at that, that's in a mile that. About five millimeters in that one. Another lobster down, I'm gonna keep that bad boy. That one will go to my girlfriend's dad because he's asked me for a nice lobster. Happy days, two down. Get in my foraging bag. I hate not having bands. Nah, so you got one, eh? Yeah, All it's right. like, you can see the claws under there, yeah. guys. If they get your leg, it seriously hurts. Look at the size of that for a top knot. That's a beauty. Woo! <laughs> He's giving me a bot whip. <laughs> there you go. You can go there. There you go, guys. These things always stick to the bottom of the rocks. Look at that. Beautiful little creature. Oh, where's he gone? 
just there. Look at this one. Oh. Did I get him? Nope. Where's he gone? Oh, there he is. <laughs> we got him. Check him out, guys. I thought that might have been another keeper, but it's definitely not. They always look a lot bigger sometimes when they're in the water. There we go, buddy. See you later. We've pretty much reached the top of the beach now, guys. So what we're going to do is go find a nice little sheltered spot. And we're going to set up the barbie and have some nice barbecue lobster at God knows what time in the morning. <laughs> you enjoyed yourself today? That's yeah, been awesome, Connor. Oh, it's been good, mate. Like, slow at the start, eh? Yeah, and then the lobsters just come out in force. So stay tuned, guys. We'll see you there. Good old barbecue at four in the morning. Trying to light. So there you go, guys. There's our wonderful uh, barbecue. <laughs> we tried. Yeah, we tried very hard. <laughs> We've had cardboard on this, paper, newspaper. And they still won't light, so I'll see you in the kitchen. <laughs> we are back in the kitchen, guys. We've got our lovely big lobster there. Nice meal. We've got a few ingredients. And all we're going to do is butterfly this lobster, mix up some garlic butter with a bit of jalapeno in there, and have some nice spicy lobster. The other lobster I'm just boiling up for my girlfriend's dad. Nice big lobster, that one. Nice solid ones as well, that's what you want. So all I'm doing with this guys, just gonna roughly chop my garlic. I want some quite big chunks, once I peeled it correctly that is, just like so. I'm not going to use all of that, there's quite a lot of garlic there, but just a good pinch, just to get the flavour going. And all we've got, some good old salt and pepper, and a bit of jalapeno peppers baby. All I'm doing guys, just roughly chopping these, just so there's a little bit of a, a crunch there. And you get the little bit of kick from the spiciness. Look at that, beautiful. And all I do is put our little concoction in the microwave just for a few seconds, let the butter melt, and we'll get our lobster ready. So there we go guys, we've got our fancy little lobster dish now. That we can just put our lobster in. Haha, <laughs> coming up in the world. So what we're gonna do is just get all of our little butter, all of our little flavors, and just cover the lobster completely in them. Nice and juicy, let's get it all over it. And all of that's just gonna melt through, it's gonna steam inside of here as well. So hopefully the claws don't dry out, because I find with oven cooking lobsters, sometimes the, uh, the claws stick a little bit. So I'm just trying to find a way to keep a bit of steam in there, and it might just steam it through instead of drying it out. Beautiful fresh lobster there. Look at the pattern on that, since it's been cooked. Pretty interesting. 
This one goes to the father-in-law. One deliciously cooked lobster right there. You're nice and spicy. All that butter there, I'm just gonna drizzle over with a spoon. It's a very full lobster, this one. Look at the meat inside that. What a beauty. Ow! That's really hot. Up! Oh. Sit! 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 Good boy! Yes, sit! Sit! Yes! Good boy! Enjoying some nice lobster with me, eh, bud? Oh no, not for long. I'm tucking into a nice big bit of tail. Oh, look at that. Prime lobster. Oven cooked is a really good way of cooking lobster. The tail just ends up falling apart. Mm. There's plenty of, uh, plenty of, plenty of spice on that. Just with the little jalapenos. Quite an interesting trip this one was at the start there wasn't much around at all we weren't finding any lobsters then we hit this one pool that was just packed they were everywhere mm. there was just multiple lobsters just walking around that night not a huge amount of keepers though we had three between us which is definitely a decent haul oh. You can't beat lobster cooked like this. There's not much ingredients with it. You get the full flavor of the lobster. You get a delicious meal with it as well. Come on up. He's getting very good at not jumping on furniture, so I can't get him up to sit with me. <laughs> You're happy, eh, bud? There you go, nice bit of a lobster for you there. The reason Smash hasn't been on videos at all is because he's had two operations in five months. Because he's a very silly boy that eats stones. So we've transformed the whole garden. Hey bud, hey, you're a nightmare, but we love you. He loves his lobster. That's why I didn't put any garlic butter on this bit, on the claws. Because you want some lobster, eh bud? Mm. There's something about foraging a lobster yourself and cooking it. There's something special with it. Brings back that primal instinct of hunting your own food. I absolutely love it. I'll never get tired of foraging lobsters, that's for sure. So I'll leave the video there, guys. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Seriously hot day today. And we're out foraging again tonight. So stay tuned. If you, if you want any merch, the link's in the description. It's Smash Fishing, baby. Woo! We're going to devour this lobster race match. Yeah, you got it, bud. Spin, 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 <laughs> sit, good boy, sit nicely, eh? Okay.